This is the part where Donald leaves the stage and goes to the crowd. And I'll be like, 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 Yeah, that time I'm right, like, in the crowd. I'm off the stage now. Why? 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 What makes you think you're the sexiest guy when it comes to this music? In a, dude, I mean, you're not terrorist. My man, I take my job very seriously. So as soon as I enter the stage, I'm not that guy. Like, you know, I'm not as confident as I as I am, like, how I am when I'm on stage. Sure. As soon as I get on stage in Fetu, I'm the best. About the I'm the best. Best, my you man. You should go to Kari TV. You, they were just feeling a corner right now. No, not right now. We are spelling. I mean, if you think you're feel a man, then you need to see me on stage. I mean, it's a different level. Ladies and gentlemen, Donald is in the studio with us. What's going on? All fam? right, boy. What's going on, fam? You, you've been working. So let's let's yeah. take it back to to uh, uh, Northwest. Originally, you're from Northwest. Originally, I am from um, Manzerre Village. Yeah. Um, I was born in Manzerre Village. Grew up in Kralhook Village. So the villages village is right next to each other in Northwest. Yeah. Like right in the Bundus, right where, you know, there's cattle and everything. And how do you find your way from uh, uh, in Como and and yeah. growing up in in that environment? <laughs> Imagine. Is it actually I think the reason why he said this is because almost every single entertainer story starts like that. No, no, yes, in Kaleg Veling Chai Fang Chai Vilu Ata. Like I've had so many interviews like that. But no, um from the age of five, I always knew that I didn't belong there. Yeah. Like I grew up thinking to myself, you know, I looked around, I'm like Okay, I mean, this is home, right? This is what I call home. But to be honest, I don't... This is not where I'm from. You feel like an outsider. Like I'm an outsider, yes. I actually grew up an outsider. I always knew that I wanted to be on TV from a very early, early age. And that time, when I look outside, there's cattle, and my dad needs to, is expecting me to make sure when he counts the cattle and the chickens, you know, we still, we still have the same number. In your house, it's long way. My man, listen... Like, I know a lot of people never believe this because I'm an R&B crooner. I'm an R&B crooner. But, brother, I used to hurt cattle, like, for real. Like, that's where I come from. When, when is this? Where, where you growing up, you're listening to the radio. Yeah. Take us back. What are you listening to that, that actually landed you yeah. to being an R&B crooner? My sister yeah. started going to school in, like, Joburg, Pretoria. Before you know it, she was in London. So she brought CDs back home. Uh -huh. It's Brian McKnight, Boys to Men, All for One. I listened to that stuff, bruh. I used to lock myself in the room and try to sing like almost each and every single one of those artists. And that's how I knew that, I right, man, listen, I can do this thing. You know? I Like, I'm... I'm better than these guys, like these guys that I'm playing with every single day. <laughs> yeah. We're playing, I mean, we used to play marbles and everything, you know? I went through basically what any any child, you know, of any young boy child goes through, you know, up, upbringing. But I always believed that I was better than that. The lady that's sitting next to you, Omba. She's beautiful. She's, wow. <laughs> and she's single. And she's single. Okay, well. <laughs> Mbali. Do you know that I have a story, ne? Yeah. But I'm gonna tell Donald oh, of wow. A. Okay. Of A. Yes. You know, send a little PM. No, he doesn't remember me. No, tell us the story. He doesn't remember me. Tell us the story. No, I hope it wasn't those days when I because I, I I used to be, you know, I wasn't was. always nice. I wasn't always nice. Yeah, yeah I was. I'm nice varsity. now. Oh really? wow. So you've changed. <laughs> wow, Mbali. Don't do I'm this just to me. asking. I, I grew up. I grew up. Oh Maybe let's God. just say that. Yeah. I'll talk to you after the show. After the show, I got you, girl. <laughs> let's do this. <laughs> yeah, have a new single out? I've got a new single out. Yeah, let's um, talk about that. It's called Nyaz Fela. Yeah. Uh, featuring Linda, the vocalist. Um, <laughs> I hope he's listening. Man. <laughs> he's a young music genius, man. Yes. I'm, um, I, I, I actually fell in love. I fell in love with music all over again. Sure. Making this album, making this specific song. Actually, the album is coming out. I just finished recording the album two weeks ago. Nice. It's called Her Name Is, and it's my fifth album. And uh, this, this is the leading single to the album. We haven't decided when the album is going to come out, but right now we're running with the single called Yaz Fela, featuring... What are, what are you working on? Because there was a time where you tweeted you want to do the dome, yes, and then yes. uh, those rumors uh, died. Just, yeah, yeah, what, yeah. And, and yeah, we were talking as friends. It told, I mean, it told me I do for no reason. Yeah, and it's too much. We actually had this conversation yeah. you and I. Yeah, I know. It's, 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 you know, the business part of it made it very difficult. 
for us to. So what are, what are, what is Donald working we, on? We 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 are working on. First of all, we restructuring. Man, I think people have have, have heard too much of my music and my style. So I'm introducing them to a, a new me in this album, and then we're working towards the next red mic experience, so which will be the the, the second one. Sasa microphone red na no. Forever, that's forever. And if it's again, I'm you know this. You've seen me, man. You've seen me. You've intro- <laughs> This guy actually introduced me um, at my 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 concert at Carnival City. Yeah, yeah. Mic experience, yeah. and that was such a that was the best day of my life. Actually, that was really. dope. That was dope. And so people yeah. must look out for a new single. A new single and a new album in in in, in a few. I'm gonna announce uh, the, the release date very soon. But yeah, man. Yes, let us know. So that's gonna push you out here, man. It's the only way forever. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the single Donald leaving the studio. But <laughs> Donald has stories number. I might not be single when I live here. You oh. Know.